I was getting views on TikTok. I'm no longer getting views on TikTok. The only videos that I'm getting any views for is YouTube, specifically videos where I look into the camera, take a sip of coffee and say, hey, Skybree, are you ready to say no to cruel and unusual punishment? So what I believe is that the elites of this world have determined what I have to say that benefits themselves. Somehow they're well versed enough on all of it to say, I understand what that means. And so they're getting a little bit of a benefit there to say, oh, okay, so I don't have to worry about cruel and unusual punishment so much. Consistently, the most people that show up to watch this video is somewhere around 400, 430 people. Here's the interesting thing. There was videos that I used to make back when the, the aliens had me convinced that I was in telepathic communication with the woman who was being held hostage. And so I would make videos where I'd say, oh, I'm going to draw and quarter you or burn you, or I would say all different kinds of stuff. And consistently around 400 to 430 people would show up to watch that. So here's the thing. I believe it's the most powerful people in the world and they're just watching things that concerns themselves. And so what I'm going to end up doing, what I believe that the aliens want me to do, they consistently said, go represent that bank, go represent that bank. I want you to represent that bank. So here's what I'm going to do. I've got manila envelopes coming in, in the mail with some post-it notes. And so I'm going to print up the summary, the one that you see on the bottom of this email or wherever you see it on my Facebook page, Tanner Ross Gregory. And so what I'm going to do is <clears throat> go to those to those banks and see if they'll, you know, the the summary is so, you know, compelling. I think that there's a, at least a chance that, you know, some bank somewhere will go, well, you know, this is obviously going to pay us back at some point if at the latest four years from now because the second piece gets the 666 talents of gold or the 666 number goes back to how many talents of gold king solomon was gifted and so i think that it may have it may have something to do with the second beast you know being four years before i can get the 1.5 billion or whatever the aliens told me to forsake them and basically just take their money and give it to myself which, I mean, by forsaking them, I think what they're saying is like, well, you're a dictator, you're doing martial law, so it's a little bit unruly what you're doing here. But at the same time, I think that, um, well, so, and, the, and then so they go, uh, you know, that's supposed to be my resurrection. And then around that time, they had me anoint my head with oil. I didn't even know what anointing my head with oil meant. So later on, I found that it had to do something with rulership or something like that. But uh, yeah, the only the only thing that I I can say, you know, at the same time, what I was saying earlier is that uh, the only way that I'm going to get ahead with all this stuff, I think, is through some kind of financial institution or somebody who has money who says, OK, I think that's going to work. I've been thinking about this for the past <clears throat> day or so, and I'm just like, you know, these motherfuckers own all the media outlets. They're not just going to let me get my fucking face out there. Somebody out there who has money is going to have to end up looking at this is what I think and saying, okay, fine, we'll help you out.